Outside at MATC's beautiful Oak Creek campus, the world is calm and serene. But on the inside, things are really cooking. And it's all due to this brand new state-of-the-art culinary facility located at the South Campus. For instructor Tom Serwillo, it's a dream come true. This facility was uh, completed about the middle of August and uh, it had been in under construction for the, for the whole summer and with the expectation of getting classes in here beginning of the fall semester. I believe the uh, cost of this facility is right around a million and a half dollars. And uh, fortunately, the school has thought enough of this program to make this sort of investment. Students here in the program are also very excited about working in this professional learning environment. I love working here at the Oak Creek campus. It's kind of a homey feeling. Everybody's here is nice and we all work together as a team and on top of that we get to serve the public and we cook with love all the time. And the chefs are, you know, very good teachers and they do a great job of showing us, you know, what we need to do and then putting us in situations that we can um, practice what we learn every day in class. Adam Gingrich also teaches at Oak Creek. Uh, we have a variety of different equipment in the kitchen from uh, ranges to uh, tilt brazers, steam kettles, uh, deep fryers, roasters, and warming ovens. Adam knows that working with top-of-the-line equipment now will make a big difference later when these students go out looking for their first jobs. These students uh, will have experience on all this equipment by the time they leave the program and this will help them in their jobs because it's the same equipment that is out there in the industry. Uh, we have Vulcan, uh, which is a well-known uh, brand uh, that makes uh, ranges, uh, Cleveland steam equipment, um, and also Alto Sham cook and hold ovens. Starting in the, in the spring semester, we will offer food for sale, uh, hopefully three days a week um, for lunch for the students, um, faculty, and staff here at the Oak Creek campus. Uh, there was a culinary presence prior to the new lab being built, and uh, the people were a little bit disappointed when that went away. So fortunately, there's almost like a pent-up demand for what we're doing now. So because of the high profile of the culinary program, uh, we've, we've certainly had a lot of people encourage us and, and, and express to us their uh, joy at us being back. Every year around this time, in the midst of the holiday season, there's one question on every cook's mind. How does one make that perfect holiday turkey? The perfect turkey. I believe uh, brining is a successful component of that. And that's essentially taking white meats, either pork or poultry, and soaking them in a salt water solution. And what that does is when you, during the cooking process, it allows the meat to stay moist and tender and not tough and dried out. From all of us here at Stormwatch, have a happy holiday season.